Hello everybody and welcome. Practiced that a few times before I got it right. Yeah. Now I've received a lot of Instagram DMs recently asking about how I stay motivated and on track towards goals that I have for myself. And this video will hopefully give you guys some tips on how to stay motivated. Da -da, da -da, motivation. Now first off guys, what we have to consider is motivation is a fleeting phenomenon. It comes and it goes. You will never be fully motivated 100% of the time. There will be weeks where you feel on top of the world, so motivated to do everything in your power to achieve your goals. The following week, I mean, it doesn't even have to be a week later, it could be a few days later, you can't be bothered with anything. It happens, it's normality, we're human, but hopefully if you employ some of these tips that I'm about to tell you, you can possibly stay a little bit more motivated towards reaching your goals. So if you find any of these tips useful, guys, please do leave a like on the video. Share the video around as well to your friends, guys, if they're lacking motivation also. So the first tip is going to be a very simple tip. It is so useful for staying motivated. Generally, you will not believe, and that is to sleep enough because every single person on the planet, no matter who they are, has a certain amount of willpower, much like petrol in a car. Humans essentially have a tank of willpower and in order to replenish that tank, you need to get enough sleep. Second tip, I preach this every single day on Instagram, get it done. Often the hardest part of anything is getting started. For example, that gym session that you really cannot be bothered with. Getting to the gym is the hardest part. If you're ever in a situation where you're doubting whether or not to do it, whether or not you can be bothered, three words, remember it every time, get it done. Tip number three, have motivating friends and family. Anyone who opposes the idea of you working towards a particular goal or can't appreciate the mindset that you have, it's brutal, but I'm gonna say it, either cut them off, ignore them, get rid of them because they are merely a speed bump. If you know what you want, guys, eliminating people that disagree with that opinion is so helpful. And bringing people in that agree with that opinion will help you stay motivated immensely. Tip number four, don't focus on the long-term goal, albeit have it in the back of your mind. Obviously, that's something you're working towards eventually, but short-term goals are where results are at. Focus on what's ahead of you directly in front. Set yourself different short-term goals each time you achieve one of your short-term goals, and that'll keep you progressing a lot faster than if you're thinking of what is in the distance. Often, when we're concentrating on something that's so far ahead, day to day is very, very easy to lose motivation. Baby steps, focus on everything day by day. I mean, this kind of rolls into the tip that I've just said, possibly my favorite quote of all time, commit to the process, detach from the outcome. For example, if your goal is to lose weight, you know that healthy nutrition, exercising, sleeping well, and drinking enough water are the ways in order to achieve weight loss. So rather than focusing on the weight loss, focus on all these points instead. Because day to day, like I said with the short term goals, focusing on them as opposed to how much weight you've lost on the scales, you're gonna end up with better progress than if you try and focus on weight loss generally. Here's another example, you've got a job interview. You're going into that interview and you want that position. That job interview is so important because you want that position. Going into the job interview thinking that, oh, am I gonna get the job, am I not gonna get the job? It's not gonna help you when you're in that interview. In that interview, you need to be focusing on being the best possible version of yourself so that when the employer comes to select you, you've done everything you can in your power to suggest that you are the correct person for that position. But if you're thinking mid-interview, oh, are they going to hire me? I wonder what they're thinking. That really doesn't help you display how brilliant you are for the position. Don't focus on results, focus on the process. Another incredibly useful tip, guys, get a training partner. It is so easy to go to the gym if only one out of two people are motivated enough to go. You end up pushing yourself further at the gym, you have a spotter, you can test your limits a lot easier than if you're going on your own, and it creates healthy competition with your exercise partner, which in turn creates better results. Another tip, stay consistent, even if you don't want to do it. Consistency over perfection. Doing something for longer will produce so much more successful results than doing something 
intensely for a short period of time and then giving up. The person that trains and eats well for two weeks will be so much more better off than the person that smashes out one week and then gives up after it. Motivation has to come from within, but you can always refuel your motivation. I do it all the time. I follow a lot of motivating people on Instagram. I watch a lot of motivating videos on YouTube. I listen to a lot of motivating podcasts. Obviously, the motivation to go gym and exercise and eat well comes from me because I want to go and do it, but I use other people as inspiration to make me go and do it. Refuel your motivation using technology, guys. It's so simple. Listen to podcasts that really make you want to go out and exercise. Follow people on Instagram that encourage you to be the best version of yourself. Use what resources we have at our disposal via technology to keep yourself motivated. Just basically it's window shopping. You're, you're taking and you're picking different bits of motivation that you can use for yourself to then go and do what you need to go and do. And my final tip for staying motivated guys is to do things that you enjoy. If you don't find it enjoyable, if you find it difficult, you find alternatives that you have genuine passions and interests in to exercise. If you don't like a particular exercise in the gym guys, find an alternative that you can do that you find more interesting and put more of your efforts in to get the results that you're looking for, especially in particular weight loss if that's what you are actually looking for. But these were just some quick motivational tips, guys. I honestly only did this video because a lot of you were asking how I stay motivated. If you found any of them useful, as I say, please leave a like. Fitness and health is a lifestyle, guys. You have to remember that. So motivation will come and go. It, it applies to every area in life, but especially losing weight, I've found people require a lot of motivation to keep going. Use these tips, incorporate them into your life, and hopefully you can stay motivated towards those goals. Good luck.